guys, welcome back. Today we're watching episode 1 of the K-drama, My Name. Now, I already watched the drama from episode 1 to episode 8, but I wanted to watch it again and talk about it with you guys. So before we start, make sure to like and subscribe, check my links, my Patreon, and yeah, let's get to it. The theme song really slaps. I love it so much. And Jiwoo being a sad, depressed teenager. We've all been there. Still there. I love the fact that Han Sui, for this show, to prepare for it, she worked out, like, diligently for four months before the show started filming. And she did all her stunt by herself. No stunt double. Han Sui cemented her place in acting by this role. She was so amazing. Like, she took herself out of the box of the seductive, girly girl feminine roles. She was just such a badass in my name. Oh yes, I remember the stupid cops. They could not find her father, so what did they do? They harassed a girl and annoyed her so that they would try to get a reaction out of her or her dad. Oh my god, leave the girl alone. They're actually following her to her school. Freaking cops. Why don't you do your job and look for her father instead of harassing her? Oh, there's gonna be one hell of a fight in that classroom. They actually have the audacity to bully a gangster's daughter. Well, they're gonna get what they deserve. The cops actually went to her school and they're just harassing her. And this damn teacher. I love how teachers, they're supposed to teach, they're supposed to be, you know, care for their students. They don't give a shit. Even the teacher is bullying her. Screw you. Oh, here's the fight. She's gonna kick some ass in this scene. What I wanna know, is this real drugs or just some dust? Because if it's real drugs, these girls got the drugs. So, where did they get it? Wait, what if the cops did it? I, I did not focus on this part, the drug part, how it got into her school bag. It's the cops. The cops did it, the school is in cahoots with them. Screw everyone, really. Yes. Give that bitch what she deserves. Yes. They actually think they're gonna win against her? A gangster's daughter? Not a chance in hell. And we're talking gangsters? That bitch? She has a, a knife. You know, a cutter. And we're talking gangsters and thugs now? She is the... She is the gangster. Yes. Boom! Thank you. You still want to talk? <laughs> Han Sui is such a girl crush in this show. She's amazing. What do you want? Yes. Leave this goddamn school. <laughs> You're not going to be able to catch her, my man. Can't even run. She's had enough. It's always to see when something bad happens, when someone feels down or upset. It's always to see that makes us feel better. On her 17th birthday, she's remembering her father when she was young. Someone shoot them. Just, just shoot them. If she's a thug, then what are you? It's her dad calling her. She's hating him for the wrong reasons. She has no idea. She's had enough. We're not settling anything and she's had enough and it's going to be a terrible, sad, miserable ending. The worst thing a father would hear is that his daughter tells him that he's dead to her. And this is why he's going to go back to her. Ah, uh, Heju. I'm telling you, the men in this show, they just decided to put some of the most handsome Korean actors in one show. And don't even get me started on their boss, Choi Mujin. I'm going to be simping for a 51-year-old man, and you're not going to hear the end of it. I'm going to keep simping over him every single episode. They are harassing his daughter, so they got what they deserve. Simple. 
an iPad and flowers are not going to make things better. She changed the lock. Or did she lock it from the inside? Oh, oh, there he is. There it is. This is how it's going to go down. No, 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 no. Yeah, he's going to keep it locked. The worst thing that could happen. There are a lot of terrible things that are going to keep happening on this show. I remember in behind the scenes, they wanted her to act this scene with uh, an earpiece to hear her father, you know, screaming and talking. But she, Hansui, refused and she wanted to have that scene with her father face to face. So yeah, Hansui, best actress. Because she wanted to feel the emotions for real. Oh, this scene always gets me. This scene is so heartbreaking. Oh, he's gone. This scene is so heartbreaking. If you watch the behind the scenes for this, the acting on both of their ends, it was amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Han Sui. She has no one. There he is, the man I'm gonna be simping over. Oh, there he is. This is a funeral. I have no shame. Well, the least he could have done is light an incense, not the cigarette. She's so broken. She wants answers. She wants to know who killed her dad. Oh god, she's gonna see her dead father in the morgue. Oh my god, her hands are shaking so bad. She's remembering, she's having flashbacks of her time with her dad before everything went to hell. The sea was their thing. Going to the beach was their thing. He wanted to take her to Jeju Island and build a house by the beach. He's not gonna be able to do that now. Oh my god, this is heartbreaking. Oh, she's at the police station wanting to know information. You son of a bitch, you. He's putting the blame and the guilt on her shoulders. Screw you. Screw you. Cops are useless. She's gonna feel guilt now. Oh, she went to Choi Mujin. She's so scared, but so did her mind to find out who killed her dad. His dagger. They have such chemistry. She's not gonna stop. She's never gonna stop until she finds out who killed her dad and why. She's been through so much and she's gonna go through more. It's not over yet. She's losing it. She is losing it. Now she's gonna take matters into her own hands. She's printed photos, uh, made copies of the surveillance photo of the killer and she's spreading it around. Desperate times calls for desperate measures. And she has no idea who's gonna call, who's gonna reach out. No, she doesn't want drugs. Stay away from her. That's the phone booth where her, her dad called her. And Choi Mujin is going to see the photo. Mm, he knows she's not gonna stop. This is so dangerous, but she's desperate. She has no other way. No. Druggies. Oh, another one behind her. Assholes. 
bastards. Oh my god, they're ganging up on her. Bastards. Ah. Uh, Shui Mujin. For the rescue. Mujin. Shui Mujin. They have such chemistry together. They have such chemistry. I really hope to see them together in another role as a couple. She's had enough. It's not your fault, honey. It's not your fault. That asshole cop putting the blame on her. The theme song. This song slaps so hard. Park Hee Soon, he is so, so handsome, such a man. I mean, he's the mob boss for a reason. Heju, you shit. Oh, her dad's ashes. Really? They're such assholes. You're not funny, my dude. Ah, oh, you just wait. <laughs> you just wait. You're gonna get your asses beat by her. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. No. Oh, he's gonna teach her. Giving her pointers. The points to attack first in order to win the vitals. She's so fine. <laughs> She's getting better. <laughs> she got him. <laughs> she got him. <laughs> Tashi. Pak Hee-soon is going to steal the show. I watched the show for Hansui but stayed for Pak Hee-soon. Come on, baby girl. As she's imagining sparring with the killer. Oh, it's the initiation fight. The winner joins the organization. And now you can all guess who's going to be the winner. It's not Gangje. It's not Gangje. No, not Gangje. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you didn't see that coming, did ya? Kangje, you are done for. He's waiting. He's watching her and waiting. This show, in my opinion, it's better than Squid Game. So now we have Han Sui, who's always been cast as the seductress, as the soft flowery feminine girl she's kicking some ass in this show and i love the fact that she took this role because it's taken her out of the box of the cutesy seductive soft girl i mean the last time she acted before my name was nevertheless she was so naive so weak so indecisive but in my name, she knew what she wanted, she knew how to get it, and she had no qualms about doing anything to get to what she wants. Don't even get me started on Choi Mujin, played by Pak Hee Soon. The first time I saw him was in Lee Jun Suk's movie, VIP, when he was a serial killer. Pak Hee Soon played a North Korean general. That was the first time I saw him, and I fell in love with him, and he literally stole the show so yeah that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like subscribe check my socials for links and i will see you on the next one bye